All right, everyone, I have two issues with today. I'm going to Hawaii, so I don't have my uh, PC, and I can't have my VR headset too, and that way I can't really actually uh, make a video. But, but, today I'm gonna be showing you how to mod in general, because last video I told you how to fix mods. Here's just how to mod in general. So to start off, you want to come over here to the first link in the description, and then that'll bring you to this section here. Am I recording? Okay. Bring you to this section here where you want to download this zip. There you go. Once you've downloaded that, you're gonna want to open it or run uh, Monkey Mod Manager. And then it's gonna open. If it does not open, you're probably gonna come up with this screen here where it's saying something is not working. We cannot locate your Gorilla Tech files. To find your Gorilla Tech files, you can go to here, profile or uh, program files 86, scroll down to Steam, and then scroll down to Steam apps, and then oh, uh, you want to go to common, and then you want to go to Gorilla Tag, and then you want to click the Gorilla Tag app or exe right here, open, and then it will bring you up to this. All of these are broken, don't use any of these, but then you want to go ahead and click Utila and BEP inject, which will automatically check X inject. You want that. Install slash update. Now you want to wait for that to download, and while you're doing that, you now want to go to the second link in the description, and then you want to go to Shiba Download, and this is where you can find the mod menu that you want. So, uh, Shiba seems to be the only one working now, but for most videos, you can go and then get the one that you want. So, obviously, I'm gonna get Shiba, because that's the one that I want. And then, you also want to come to here, get the Utila Fix, because this is the Fix Utila. But for people in the future, you might not have to get the fix. You then, for uh, if, you, if you want a camera, you can go ahead and go to some server to get that camera. But for now, just go to the Discord server that I have linked to my channel. And then I can help you get a camera from there. But now that this install is complete, you want to click Utilities, and then you want to click Bepinex folder. That'll open up to this. First, in config, before you launch your game, make sure there is no configs except for this one. Um, because then your game won't work. Then here, you can see here's what we have. You want to go ahead and click downloads. And then get your menu and put it into here. And then for people like who've seen this recently, you want to just go ahead and get this utility. Don't, don't mind why I'm renaming it. But you just want to get this. Uh, you, oh my gosh, you know what, whatever. Get this utility and then place it into that folder. That is if, like, you're watching this now. And then, um, this is what you have. But still, the game is not gonna work this way. You need to go to the Discord, the third link in the description for Aspect Scrib. Then you want to go down to Code, just found right here under the For Developers tab. And then, here it is, all of this here. You want to scroll up. And by the way, here's a template to get uh, mods, to get uh, like a uh, uh, to make your own menu. But you want to go to here where he says you fix lag, and then you want to download this, and this will fix your mods. But you don't need this if you're like a month from now, because then everything will be patched. But for people who are watching this like pretty recently, just go ahead and drag this into here, and now you have mods. All your mods will work. Um, I will also have, obviously, the link in the description for the Monkey Mod Manager, the link in the description for the Shiba menu, which is what I use, and the link in the description for Aspect Scrib. Um, so if you guys need any help with anything or something doesn't work, go right here to Modding Help, and then uh, go ahead and type at MBYT, and then say what your issue is, my issue is blah blah blah. blah. Whatever your issue is, and then I will respond very quickly. Before I end the video, I just want to make sure that you guys at least try to go and check out my new group on Roblox because, well, I, I like people in here. I'm going to be making merch for the minimum price of 5, the maximum for maybe 15, but so far it's just around 10. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video, hope this helps, and I will see you guys in the next video.